What's up, guys? Mecha Ishe with my beautiful kids, Ty and Liz. Say hi. Hi. And for you Funko Pop collectors, we're having Funko Fun Time. We got a lot of pops to show you guys. So you know what, kids? Tell them something. Let's do it. <laughs> Step out of your world and step in your world. Hi! What's up, everybody? Mecca is here. I got my beautiful daughter, Alyssa. Say hi. Hey. And I got Ty. Say hi. Hello. And as you can see, we are behind a wall, a fortress of Funko Pops. For you guys out there that are big fans of the Funko as we are, this video is for you. So we got a ton of stuff going on here. We got 42 Funko figures that we're going to be talking to you guys about. Alyssa got her own little section. Tyler has his little section. And if you catch the recent video of Toy Time with Ty, I will show you a few more figures that he got. So don't feel bad for him. He got plenty of Funko figures, all right? And I got my section, of course. So let's just start opening them and let's get to it. We're going to do a little review for you guys and have a lot of fun. All right, guys. So we're going to start off with Ty here. And he's going to be talking about the four figures. Oh, only four figures. Don't feel bad. Don't feel, it's, it's okay, I'm Ty. Fine. He's fine. He got toy time with Ty. Check it out. He has a bunch of Funko figures. He's going to be all right in life, all right? But uh, we got... He had four figures here that we've been picking up, and these are figures he actually picked up and was excited about. So he's going to get to it, and uh, yeah, Ty, I'll let you take it away. So now we have Yondu <laughs> from the Guardians of the Galaxy, and I like how he has the red mohawk. Orangey red. Yeah, it's like orangey red, right? <laughs> and, why, and I didn't see this in the movie, but he had... Purple hair. Yeah. Where? I may be pretty as an angel, but that don't mean I am one. Remember that? No. That was awesome. You were sleeping. But what yeah, go ahead. Keep you talking about sleep. him. And I like the black, the, what is maroon? that? It's trench coat. No? What, what color is that? Yeah, it looks like maroon, right? Mm -hmm. Some some reddish color. And the cape, I love the cape. The jacket is ripped. It is? Yeah, you got a rip right yeah, there in the bottom. And it has the arrow hit weapon. And I like the red. Yeah, very cool figure. Uh, Yandu is an awesome character from the original, if you guys don't know, from the Marvel comics, original Guardians of the Galaxy. Yandu was totally different in the way they portrayed him in the Guardians of the Galaxy movie. But they did an awesome job. I love the way they made him look. Very awesome dude, especially when he does that whistle tie. Right, he whistles and that, that, that arrow just goes, right? <laughs> and that's it. He wins. Daddy? Yes? You said Yondu wrong. You're supposed to say Yondu. Oh. Yondu. Good? Mm. Is that better? Yes. All right. Let's talk about the next one. So now we have the Nebula. 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 Yeah. There you go. Nebula. Nebula. <laughs> oh, God. All right. Anyway, talk about the figure. From the Guardians of the Galaxy 2. <laughs> no, he was in Guardians of the Galaxy 1. <laughs> Guardians of the Galaxy 2 didn't come out yet. <laughs> All right. Anyway, what do you like about Nebula? Nebula. <laughs> oh, brother. That's... She has hair or metal? No, it's metal. She's like a cyborg. Remember Thanos' daughter? She experimented oh, yeah, on yeah, her. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. And why is her eye? Uh, She's a cyborg. She's a cyborg. So she has like robotic parts, like cyborg from Teen Titans. Oh, yeah. Remember? Yeah. So she that makes her a better fighter, a better whatever, whatever she needs to be is because of those cybernetic implants. She looks weird. Yeah, she's supposed to be. She's with a the, cyborg. No, with the tiny body and the big oh, head. Yeah. yeah, she got a really small body, guys. She, You gotta be... It takes a little while, right? Let's see if we can stand her up in one shot. <laughs> oh, backflip. She did a backflip. Okay, we're good. We're good. So we got it. And I love the colors, right, Liz? Do you love those colors? I like the head colors. I like that. What is that? A nice lavender. She got the nice silver paint going on. And the cyborg touch is very nice. Very so nice. Now we have Aquaman from Superman versus <laughs> Batman. <laughs> yep. You said it right. It's Batman v Superman. Batman versus Superman. But you just did it in reverse. But it's the same thing. <laughs> Superman is still fighting Batman and Batman is still fighting Superman, right? Yeah. So yeah, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> and I like how. Is that the one? The water, the water, the hair looks weird. Yeah, it looks 
like he almost seaweed, right? But that's, <laughs> yeah. that's just the color of his hair. He got the brown hair, and he got some yellowish effect, uh, like yellowish streaks going down his hair. Almost looks like, like seaweed, right? Mm -hmm. He's been down in the ocean far too long. But why don't you have this? She never that's his it's trident. his trident. That's his, that's his weapon. That's his, it's a trident, even though this has five prongs, but that's his weapon. Ooh. Wait, so does maybe, it usually have three prongs? Yeah, a trident means three. And I like how it has the green pants, and it looks like dragon scales. Yeah, that's very And it feels good. like it. Yeah, very good pickup tie. And, and I like the gold, gold well with the green, but... <laughs> it goes well with his weapon, and I that beard is just too big. <laughs> but yeah, that's Aquaman from Batman v Superman Funko Pop do, form. Do, 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 do. It is him. Superman. <laughs> oh, epic! <laughs> talk about the boy. I talk about the Superman. The Superman from Batman versus Superman. There you go. And I like how he has the hair. <laughs> <laughs> he comes with an awesome flight stand, guys. You don't see that a lot in the Funko Pop line, but it's so cool when they add it. And, you know, go ahead. I'll let Ty. Oh, that very good. That went on very well. Go ahead. Keep talking about him, Ty. And I like how he looks like he's about to punch you. Yep, he's flying in. He's coming in hard. Oh, and he crashed. <laughs> and I like how it says, It's with you, Batman! <laughs> yeah, this is his costume, the way it looks in the Batman v Superman movie. And I just love the hair. I'm a big fan of that hair. Look at that. No, I have a hat on right now. <laughs> you know, I buy too many toys. I can't afford a haircut. But, uh, yeah, we got this awesome hair, which I will work on next time. I'm going to just bring this into the barbershop and say, I want this. Do this. I think that that can be done, right? Yeah, you could do yeah. You got a little bit of Superman going on. Superboy. All right, and he has a stand which go. There's a little hole. Oh man, there's a hole, and uh, this goes. Anyway, it goes back there. So, <laughs> Tyler, that's awesome. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> All right, let's go to Alyssa. No way. All right, guys, so now we're going to get into Alyssa's section, and she has 12 awesome-looking Funkos, a lot of females, and I'm just looking at their hair, and these girls are painted so well, um, I mean, and sculpted so well, so uh, I'm going to let Alyssa get to it, and she's going to go one by one. Let's do so it. First, I'm going to show my pinky from Pac-Man. I don't really play Pac-Man at all or know anything about it. She just looks so cute. Because of her, like, sleepy eyes and her, um, thumbs up. <laughs> I also like that she's, like, floating in the air. Because she has an invisible stand that you cannot take off. So this is Marco Mole. <laughs> Morocco Mole. He's <laughs> from the Hanna-Barbera line. So I, I, I know she doesn't know anything about Hanna-Barbera, you know, the Flintstones and all those kind of guys. No clue. But uh, that, yeah, this is one of the characters, I guess. I don't even know Morocco Mole. I know a lot of the Hanna-Barbera characters, but this is something she just picked up. So go ahead, talk. Why, why did you pick up Morocco Mole? Because he has, his eyes are like inside his face. That oh, makes yeah. him even cuter. He's squishy. <laughs> he looks like he's squishy. Morocco Mole looks like he's about to graduate. <laughs> he looks like he graduated. Yeah, he looks intelligent, right? Today. He, I mean, you know guys with glasses are super smart. So, that's a fact, Jack. I really like how he has the little baby pink cat on his head. I he's, He looks like he's pouring to bed. Hey, Morocco. I also, and... I just like him because he's so cute and chunky. Yep. Now I want to show um, Ham from Toy Story. I got him because he he actually looks like a piggy bank. He has like the way the spot where the money comes out on his stomach hmm. and where you put the money in on his back. I also like his little piggy tail. He 
that where you put the money? It looks like meat from a hamburger. Okay. <laughs> I think Tyler's hungry. Yes. He is hungry, huh? Oh boy, we got to feed the beast. Uh, anything else you want to talk about, Ham? No, not really. All right, let's go on to the next one. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, what about his head? His head. Oh! And real quick, the Morocco Mole and the uh, Pinky Dinky figure, they don't have any articulation here. And Morocco Mole also is just... Oh, he's he really, squishy. He looks I squishy. He's squishy. Hey, come on, everybody, get a feel. Feel it with He's us. squishy. Go ahead. Next is Maria from the Book of Life. I love her hair. It it actually has like really good texture because it had it shows all of the curls and it's very very long. That is a beautiful hair sculpt. She she also has um, a red rubber band like on the top of her head, and she's holding a sword, but she didn't use it in the movie though. So whose sword is it? A boyfriend's? <laughs> Probably, I forget. Oh, but she's beautiful. This is a beautiful figure. Wow. I mean, I didn't watch the Book of Life. I did. So I didn't know about the character, but I knew Alyssa watched it, and Alyssa was a big I fan of these characters. Yeah, Tyler too. What do you I love, I really, really like how the dress has like ruffles, and it it has orange and, orange and yellow stripes. It's beautiful. And it comes with a stand? Yes. Oh. Look at that, because she's so top-heavy with all that beautiful hair and the gigantic pop head. This is what happens when you don't have a stand. So now I'm going to talk about Sally from The Nightmare Before Christmas. Her hair, is it looks pretty long, and I love how she has a cat right like behind her, kind of. She, she also will not stand without... The, the invisible standy thingy. <laughs> and on the jar, it, it says Deadly Nightshade from the movie. So, I also, it also has like the stitches, which kind of looks weird though. Did her eye, did, her, did she get busted open so she needed stitches? <laughs> She's like Frankenstein, but a girl. She was put together by someone, right? Yeah, that got ripped up. Yeah, take it easy over there, Tyler. <laughs> My goodness. I really like her dress because it's like pink, gray, and yellow all over it. That's beautiful. <laughs> I really, I love the pattern that it has. Oh, and if you and when, if you look really closely, you kind of see like little swirls sculpted inside of it. That's a good attention to detail there, Liz. Very good job. And she has that jar. Yes. A nice jar, right? Yeah, she's very pretty for a Frankenstein-looking girl. Mm. So nightmare, nightmare Before Christmas Funko Pop figure. Anything else you want to say about her? Uh, no. All right, let's go to the next one. This is Sadness from Inside Out. Um, it's actually Mom's. She w she told me to show it though. She's really cute and fluffy. I, her glasses aren't really that much attached. You, you, you it's see? just glued on, right? It's yeah. just glued on right at the nose the piece. Her scratches <laughs> are not. I, I just are I, not on there because of her Chandler's hair. <laughs> <laughs> I really love the color of her sweater. It's very pretty, and it's white and. No. <laughs> it is a pretty sweater tie. It's pretty blue. And, and the shoes are, she's wearing like, uh, slippers for shoes. What? <laughs> That's what you wear when you're sad. You know, you throw on a sweater, some <laughs> slippers, and you're good. You I sad, what, I, mean. I wonder if she likes ice cream. What? <laughs> <laughs> and bonbons, right? Her head also moves kind of. But like it won't stay in one place. I wonder if she likes. It slowly moves back to the middle. Slowly. Hmm. So yeah. Oh, there you go. Just have to give a little force, but in that case, you got to be careful because if if there's some resistance, you might snap the plastic. So 
This one does, it just had to give a little a little bit of force and now you see the articulation is well, good. Now I'm gonna show you Wonder Woman from Batman versus Superman. I, I really, really like how like, when you look like, close at her um, wristband thingies, you could see like sculpts of like diamonds. Ooh, wow, that looks expensive. <laughs> She is an Amazonian princess, That's can I cheat? That's true. Where are her diamonds? Uh, I also like her sword. It's flimsy. Her and at the end of, at the tip of it, like right after you see her holding onto it, you could see that there's like blue designed in it too, which I really like. I also like her hair. Very nice. I actually did not notice that there's like a star in the middle of the crown thingy. That's the princess with her tiara, right? Fancy. Yeah. She looks awesome. I really, I like the red on her boots. Fancy. Now red. this is Louis from Tiana. He he has like a very detailed smile. His teeth are like like greenish yellow. -y. They actually sculpted the teeth. He looks awesome. I love him. Wow. I really, really, really like how he has his little what what's it trumpet. called? Trumpet. Trumpet. Yeah. yeah. When he, and I re, I really liked the part when they were on the boat and he was just like playing. Yeah, from the from the movie playing, playing. Princess and the Frog with Princess Tiana. Great movie. Uh, the first movie I took Alyssa to when she was only three years old. Yeah. It was just me and Alyssa. Daddy and Daughter Day. We had a good time, right Liz? We went to Toys R Us. Yeah, we always go to Toys R Us. I mean, come on. <laughs> when, when you um, touch his hand, you can actually feel that his fingernails are spiky. It was a sharp fingernail, huh? Well, what do you expect? He's a crocodile. And I I like the um, scaly things on his back. Yeah, that's awesome. Great figure. You can see right here with this figure, it's not your traditional pop figure. They actually put a lot of detail to make it look like an alligator. And this is awesome. So this is from Princess and the Frog, Louie. Louie! This is Tigress from Kung Fu Panda. And on her um, palm, you could see that it's a circle marking which I think is pretty cool. And this also is like, this could be fluffy. They could add an exclusive one with fluffy fur here. They should. <laughs> what are you, a Funko Pop Diva? Relax. <laughs> well, they should. The demands are too high. The demands are too great. But yeah, that's Tigers. Tigers are from Kung Fu Panda, like Alyssa said. Great yeah. character. Voiced by Angelina Jolie. Really? Yeah. See, you learn something new every day with daddy. And yeah, this is a cool figure. What about the paint job on the face? That looks so awesome. There's, there's like another circle-y thing on, right there on the forehead. Love the stripes that they put on there, right? I like the tail because it's like orangey black, brownish black or whatever. And then it goes into white. White and that color. I don't really know what it is. It's like grayish. Very cool looking figure in her action pose, ready to do some Kung Fu, right? So now this is Scarlet Witch from Avengers Age of Ultron. I really, really, I really like how um, she has the shiny boot. And then like here where it goes to the ankle thingy area, it kind of has like a matte look, doesn't it? Oh, backflip, backflip. <laughs> And she also has like a bobbly head. Yeah, like the Marvel figures, right? All the Marvel figures, Marvel figures have bobble action. Well, she also is wearing a minty green necklace and above it is a red one. You see? I also like how she's like holding her hands out there. <laughs> she's doing her Scarlet Witch magic, right? Mm-hmm. She, I really like the detail they put into on her um, eyeshadow. 
and her skirt. And a dress skirt, whatever. Everything. And that's Scarlet Witch from the Age of Ultron. Yeah. So now this is Black Widow, also from Age of Ultron. Well, this is actually from the Civil War, Black Widow. But she was in Age of Ultron because she's an Avenger, right? Yes. But, oh, that's a cool looking costume. I just noticed she's wearing... Oh, she's going to be wearing her traditional gray and black, it seems, in the Civil War movie. So keep an eye out for that. <laughs> when she just wore standard black and blue or whatever it was. But, yeah. I, I, she also has, like, the shiny boots. And then when it goes... Well, for her, when it goes, like, above the knee... It's matte, a little small circle-y thing. It's matte, kind of. Her hair... It's glossy. Yes, kind of. Her hair bounces with her head. <laughs> she has bouncy hair using great shampoo and conditioner. <laughs> <laughs> uh, again, bobble action and great sculpt work on the hair. Now this is Black Canary from the Arrow TV show. Um, I, I like her hair because like, it's like twirling. Every time it goes down. Show them on camera. But like, on, yeah. but like when you go to the front side of the hair, it's like fatter than in the back. I think that's a style of women do. I don't do that. Um, You're a I girl. really like again with the glossiness. I like the glossy um eye mask thingy. Her eyes are like really bulging out. Look at it. Side angle. <laughs> Anything else you want to say about Black Canary? I thought it was Arrow when I first saw her. She did. She thought it was Arrow and then comes home and saying, Oh, yay! <laughs> it's Black Canary! I, uh, her boots are really big, too. Oh, good. <laughs> She's not like the other girls in the line. She, she can actually stand up a little bit. There her, you go. Her eyes look like it's popping out of her face. I yeah, it does. That. It does. That's just maybe the effect of the mask. <laughs> But that is Black Canary from the Arrow TV series. Boom!